Hey y'all, I'm Parisian and this is Dream of Parisian Tarot. We're gonna get a few cards from my Aquarius, okay? So please like this video if it resonates at all. Let's get a few cards from my Aquarius. Alright, so the first card I'm seeing, it says fantasizing about you, okay? They feel like you're going to take their man away. So someone's upset about you, about your masculine. They want to have a conversation with you, but they know it's going to be awkward. And you need to be careful with absorbing bad energy, okay? So you could definitely be a bit of an empath. A karmic is facing reality of defeat. It says, I wish I never did this to you. So someone's feeling really, really bad about doing something to you. And a karmic may be wanting to attack you over your man. We got remembering old memories. So thinking back on the past a lot. And they had a lot about you. And 10, 10, you need to focus on your spiritual growth. Which is telling me some of y'all are into your spirituality. But it says, people notice you're always doing something different. So you could be switching things up, doing something different, creating something new. And it says, they want your twin flame connection. So you could be connected to your twin flame and another person wants your twin flame. You could be investing in yourself or about to. And you need to meet your internet friends. Some of y'all could be content creators, influencers, or just getting some type of attention in some type of way. But you got internet friends who may be loyal supporters or genuinely wanting to meet up with you, okay? Or be friends. Someone could be currently awaiting trial. And you look good on camera. Your family is closed-minded, so your family members may not be agreeing with something that you want to do or agreeing with someone that you're wanting to date. You put it where it fits, but someone's family members could be maybe trying to block something. We have arguments with the mother. I'm also seeing something about a sister. This could be your sister, his sister, somebody's sister is involved. We also have a drunk auntie. This could be your drunk auntie, his drunk auntie, somebody auntie. And your skills are being tested at this time, okay? I'm seeing something about an ultrasound. It says, everyone knows she did wrong for what she did. So a female energy may have done you wrong. And everyone knows it. Everyone can see it. We got Enki, God of Water, Crafts, Knowledge, and Creation. Someone's definitely a creator. Yeah. It says your topics create controversy. So something that you're doing is having a lot of people talking. They could be want to argue or debate you over or something like that. But it's something big, right? Um, and it has something to do with the internet. You look good on the internet or something. We got no face, no case, which means someone's talking about another person's naked pictures. You could be decorating something or creating something new. Someone's definitely into the arts. Screaming and crying over you. A friend is unable to move on from you. So look, I feel like there's definitely like a female friend or a fake friend that's like screaming and crying because they face a reality of some type of defeat for trying to sabotage you or attack you, okay? Because they wanted to take your man. Or something. Okay. Also because some type of work. Or something that you're creating. You need to take care of you. Okay. You also need to rest and rejuvenate. Which means some of y'all could be tired or drained. Spending all the money on weed. And my words against yours. Which means that people are like. Like picking sides or somebody's like trying to tell their side against yours or something. And feeling like giving up. You could be going on a fruit cleanse or you might need to go on a fruit cleanse. We got a DNA test. Someone could be needing a DNA test or getting one. 
separating the real from the fake, which means fake people are being exposed. You starting to see them. Oh my God, please just love me, which means somebody could want their person to love them. You could be dealing with the superficial masculine. Don't make me call my brothers, which means somebody could be trying to get their kinfolk or their brothers or something like that to like attack a masculine or somebody else or something. Surround yourself with people who want to see you win, which means you didn't have the best of people around you who wanted to see you win. And now you could be burning bridges and cutting people off for your new beginning. Desperate for your help or assistance. Someone needs your help. Long braids. Someone could have long braids. They told people you was promiscuous. So they told people that you were dealing with this person, that person, everybody. But, you know, you deserve a life of comfort and luxury. And they notice you immediately. All right? So you shine bright. And they was just jealous of your spirituality. He cut her off. So he cut off a feminine energy. Now she could be trying to attack you. Somebody could be going to a wrestling show or event. And get in a condo. Or someone's planning to. Texas Roadhouse. Somebody could want to take it to a restaurant. That's a restaurant. But somebody's thinking of painful memories of you. All right, look, someone is going through something really, really painful right now. All right, it could be some type of breakup or heartbreak or something. And it could have, like, detached or went introverted. Introverted is right here. Um, but it also is giving them time to really think about things. But it's like it also shook them up inside and making them realize how much they love you. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. Karmic mad about the opportunity that you're getting. So your masculine wants to give you some type of opportunity or love or something like that. Another person knows about it and they're getting upset. They don't like you, but I still want to be your friend. So somebody's stuck in the middle knowing that a certain person don't like you, but they actually want to be your friend. Arguing about break time. I'm glad that came out. Um, Someone, it could definitely be on the masculine's side but it could be on yours too someone's definitely having real big issues at work so from what i was getting in the pre-show full the masculine could have been dealing with females at work right he could have stopped dealing with some females at work over some type of mess but the mess could also be revolving around you okay maybe the person that he was dealing with and flirting with at work found out about you or something like that and they've been trying to attack you and the masculine ever since now the masculine can't get rid of them in some type of way okay it could result in someone getting fired or maybe they someone did get fired or something like that okay oh it's about to but um it's like an annoyance all right if the, if the person didn't leave yet it's like it's an annoyance every time they go to work and have to deal with this person or something like that. It's like they wishing they never dealt with them because it became real messy or something. All right. But now they coming in with the offer and your person is finding out that these people was liars. They was lying on you. We got a new call. Someone could be getting a new call. And we got kicked down the door. So when kicked down the door comes out, that means that someone's trying to force themselves into a certain situation or force themselves in someone's house or something, okay? They want to recruit you. Stole from you, though. And you are a love magnet. So a lot of people are attracted to you, okay? But there is dark energy trying to attack you. <clears throat> She is starting to ask questions. Issues with booking. So somebody could have issues with booking something. Maybe they're having issues booking a wrestling show or a condo. Or maybe you got some type of business. Someone's having issues booking something up. Okay. A lot of arguments going on. Making a movie. Could be looking slimmer. So someone have been losing weight. Somebody looking good. And someone's asking, how did you know that? So you knew something. You posted something. You said something. They try to figure out how you knew. 
in need of emotional connection. That's what I'm saying. Someone has went through a lot, has been crying, very sad, and they need your emotional connection. But there may not be any communication between y'all right now or something. Someone is dealing with an obnoxious teacher or could be an obnoxious teacher. You have, you have a past life connection with your person. And they could be reaching out after going ghost. But they scared of rejection. So something is holding them back. They scared of your rejection. Someone could be a concert promoter. So I'm seeing stuff like make a movie concert promoter. Somebody is in front of the camera or a content creator, influencer, something, right? Somebody making moves. <clears throat> but your person could have been cheating. Ooh, but it's like you got fans, honey. They realize you're not a group. So you got, they realize you're not a groupie and they told people you was permitted. So somebody was real there trying to play you like you was really out there talking to everybody. But your person realized that you're not a groupie. You got a check in the mail coming in or some type of money. Someone could be going undercover to get more information. A failed drug test or someone might have to take a drug test. And they say, don't let me go. So your person, even if there's a breakup or some type of separation or something, don't let them go. Um, you won't be able to let them go anyway because if it's your twin flame, then that's like a forever type thing. And so she holding a grudge against you. Someone could be in cosmetology school. They could have something to do with the obnoxious teacher somewhere. And mindset matters. So you're starting to really look at people's mindsets and pick and choose who you're going to let in your life and who not. Who you're not going to let in your life, Okay. Um, a parole officer. We do got criminal. No, currently. I was going to say criminal family member, but that don't say criminal family member. Currently awaiting trial. So someone could have criminal family members, okay? That's awaiting trial. They want to debate you. Yeah, because um, your topics are controversy, and a lot of people want to um, talk to you or meet with you or something like that. You know, they don't want to have a romantic getaway with you. But some type of sneaky link backfired. Aliens have been watching you, which means you got some type of powerful purpose or something that you may be doing that's important. Okay, so not only... It's, it could have been some type of party or something because we got drunk auntie. Now we got drunk sister. And then we got sister over here too. Now we do got arguments with a mother as well. So, and then we did have arguments too. So it's like a lot of arguments and fights could be with family members, could be with people at work as well, or some type of teacher. It's a lot going on here. What else we got? Yeah, it could be some type of cancel plans because it could have been issues with booking something, or Airbnb, a, a condo, something, and abundant money is coming in, okay? Also, no, if this is not happening directly to you, it could be happening to your person or somebody around you. So put it wherever it fits, okay? <clears throat> I could be saying he, when really it could be a she. So flip it and reverse it how I need be. And y'all, please don't forget to hit that like button. It really helps out my channel. All right. Let's see what we got. As soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Aquarius is, oh, okay. We got the fairy bee. It says my life is sweet. So your life is about to become sweet. Or you're about to get some type of abundance so things going to balance out well, okay? And then we got dragon, dragonling garden. A new world is born, which means you're about to have some type of new beginning. You could be. It could be repurposing things or trying to find your purpose in some type of way. Or maybe you did find your purpose, but I'm definitely getting a whole bunch of new beginning energy. As you can see, key, new beginnings. All right, that's the energy everybody need to be seeing for today. New beginning energy is starting right now. So, you know, when, when things end, you're about to have some type of new beginning. All right, something new is coming. Something new is being created. <clears throat> With every ending is a new beginning. Cars. My Aquarius is all right. What we got here? All right. So it says sacred beetle armor. You have a mighty shield, which means you have protection. Someone is protecting you. Okay. Which means you could be getting attacked. 
Someone could be trying to attack your creative work. You get what I'm saying? Once upon a midnight dreary, creativity, genius, writing, expression, artistic flow. Someone's trying to block your artistic flow, your work, your creativity, your 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 spotlight, your shine, whatever it is that you do, whatever you got going on, someone may have been trying to block it, but you have a mighty shield. You also need some space from another person. This could be a lover, a friend, a family member, but you need space in a relationship, okay? Somebody need to go for right now. Let's see. So you can have this new beginning. As soon as I open up the deck, we'll be seeing seven of cups. So you got options, right? And you could be thumbing through your options trying to figure out how to make more money at this time. Some of y'all are celebrities, okay? You could have been doing some healing too over a love situation. Something could have got really, really heated. Someone definitely got potential to be a star. Also, someone could be moving or relocating or wanting a new home. All right. Then we got the Six of Cups. Somebody definitely wants to give you some type of gift. I was seeing that heavy in the pre shuffle. Somebody wants to give another person a gift. Now, a gift could be anything tangible, it could be a form of love, expression, whatever it is, but they want to give some type of gift. Okay. Somebody wants to cut through the BS as well. Pause for my BS's. Yeah, ten of pentacles. So someone could be trying to get away from their family. Or could be annoyed by their family. So you are uh, you this is what you want to see. You got the chariot coming out with the ten of pentacles, all right? So that's like family, stability, security, longevity. And then we got the chariot, which is about victory and success. Also, somebody could be getting a new car and want them to travel. But someone could definitely also be trying to figure out which way to go or confused on a few things. All right. Something involving family. Now this person could definitely want a family with you if you don't already have a family with this person. But someone's trying to get away from another person so they can like be happy with what they have or what's coming seven of cups they definitely looking through their options right now because they want to like apologize but they waiting for the right time because they something is at a distance either they either your lover is at a distance or they feel like you at a distance or um someone might have to travel soon justice so somebody's about to get some type of karma and somebody having legal issues. They finna get some type of judgment. So somebody could be going away or sent away. Somebody might have to go out of town to handle some business. Let me see. Somebody could be traveling though with family or people that they see, see as family. Seven of Swords, we see somebody trying to steal somebody's money or something. So the Seven of Swords is about stealing, cheating, lying, any type of manipulation. As you can see, they doing stuff they ain't got nothing to do with, stealing stuff, right? The Four of Pentacles, you see how this person is sitting on their treasure. This card is about saving money or keeping things a secret and stuff like that. So it's like somebody trying to keep something a secret that they was trying to steal or rob another person. Rob them of a somebody from their past. Keeping secrets about somebody from their past. They was juggling, going back and forth. And it caused a heartbreak, third-party situation. So, someone was hiding the fact that they were sneaking and talking to another person from their past. Also, this got something to do with someone's money or abundance. Someone was trying to steal another person's money or abundance. And it could have been an ending. So, it's like... This person wanted to meet up with you, be with you, see with you, but there could have been some type of abrupt ending between you and your person. I'm also seeing death energy. So I'm seeing cancer energy and I'm seeing Scorpio energy. All right. And then we got the four of wands. But it's like a group of people work together to get two people to break up. That's what I'm seeing. That's what I'm saying. But... They didn't break up. So, it's like, even if it seems like an ending, it's not really an ending. Because, you know, endings are just transformations. This person wants to come bring you an opportunity. You're getting an opportunity. Another person is getting mad. Your wishes are about to come true. Something that you've been wishing for. 
because they all love each other, right? So this is a spiritual union between two people, but somebody got choices in love when this card comes out. The lovers. Also, a Gemini could have something to do with this. So we got Cancer, Scorpio, and Gemini. They want to come in and bring you love. The thing about it is that they could just be fantasizing about it a lot, but not actually taking action. All right, where we on? We already on 20. Let me hurry up. As soon as I open up the deck, what we saying? All right, y'all glow up, got people in their feelings. So you didn't glow up, you level up. People could be getting upset and hating and mad and stuff like that, okay? So that explains um, you look good in the camera, making movies, uh, stuff like that, okay? Some of y'all could be entrepreneurs or something, okay? Or content creators. They want to trap you to keep you, all right? They could definitely want to get you pregnant, have a family with you, okay, to keep you. But they're also afraid of their feelings and they're scared of being rejected if they come towards you and tell you all of this, all right? So they might have did something to break you hard or put you in a third-party situation. It says, God put you together perfectly for me. So I made this card for when you look very beautiful, all right? Your person feels like you were made perfectly for them. But someone is attacking, attacking your beauty in some type of way because they're hating. They could be attacking your hair, um, your looks, your skin, your coat, whatever it is. Someone's attacking your beauty, but your person feels like you are perfect for them, okay? They know how much I love you, and that's why they are mad. See, someone's upset that your person is in love with you, okay? So they're trying to attack you. And they say, he only has eyes for you, and it kills me. So that's why they keep attacking me. And they were speaking bad on your name. They painted you out to be a bad person or like a harlot or something, okay? He came out again. I want to come prepared for you. So your masculine is getting themselves ready for you. So this may take time. So time could be a factor. It came out again. Something about some false rumors going on as well. But we already know that because they said that the painting you have to be a bad person. I mean, there's too many, but we're going to take it. I don't want you to have him, which is why they're spreading all these rumors and causing issues. I want to learn everything about you. I really do feel like your person is. Also, your person could be riding past your house, okay? Um, it says, I won't stop fighting for this connection because they ain't love with you, right? They don't want to give up on this connection. But there's more than one karmic involved, and it could definitely be they family members, okay? Now, remember, karmics are not always the other woman. Karmics could be family members and friends, too. But look, <clears throat> the whole family is in it. Family got in the way. And they say your glow up got people in their feelings. It came out again because you got some type of business improvement. You're doing good within your career or whatever you're creating or whatever you're posting, right? It's being highly talked about. And it says, I have looked at wedding rings. So your person sees you as wifey or hubby material, okay? They want to marry you. I want to come prepare for you again is here. And when we got She Likes Girls. So a lot of times when this card comes out, you could definitely be bisexual or this could be a same-sex relationship. But um, um, somebody they're dealing with also want to do you too, okay? That's usually when the card comes out. All right. As soon as I open up that, what we're seeing from my Aquarius is maybe. So this connection has a lot of potential. The potential to happen is there, okay? But there's like a blockage or something. Your person wants to give you some type of gift, okay? Mm -hmm. They want to get you pregnant. They want that family with you, okay? But it's a whole bunch of rumors. They've been hanging with their friends, talking about you and stuff. They want to get to know you better, so they want some one-on-one -on -one time with you. So, that could be a blockage with y'all seeing each other. Would that explains the distance or something? Some type of no. Okay, so he could have lustful eyes or lustful eyes for other people or something. So, you could have told them no or not giving them some right now. And things could be unclear between y'all, but he put you on a pedestal. And he want to come in and fix the situation because he got faith in destiny. And we got uncharted territory. This card means new level of unconditional love. So, they have unconditional love for you. Love that they never felt before before anybody else, okay? You made them, like, see that 
Yeah, I got a past life connection, but he got addictions. This could be alcohol, drugs, whatever it is. And there's a lot of arguments going on. And this could be a twin flame. We seen that earlier. Let me get they want to see you too. Yeah. Lust. Open for love. They want to bang. <laughs> okay. Open for love again and faith and destiny. So they got faith that you'll be open to whatever they want to give you, whatever offer. As soon as I open up that, what we're saying for my Aquarius, yeah. So people trying to figure out how do you do what you do, okay? So you do something, everybody trying to figure out how you be doing it, right? Uh, so, all right. So this is good. You got good news is on its way to you, right? But it's say, like, what if I open up and tell you how I feel and you don't feel the same? Yeah. So it's like, y'all not might not be talking as much or something like that or really truly expressing how you feel because someone's afraid of their person rejecting them or not feeling the same because it will hurt even worse if you actually end up expressing how you truly feel for this person and they don't even feel the same when you can just keep it to yourself and then if you don't know then it's just in the air and it won't hurt as bad all right uh family members think they know what's best for you see family members causing issues up in the situation upset that they missed out on the opportunity with you because they could have like put you in third party situation and chose somebody else over you trying to get their hands on something that is yours your possessions have your energy keep your stuff to yourself you was being treated badly and you are a woman that doesn't give just anyone the time of day because somebody was trying to play you like you was a harlot um they know that you're about to come up and think that they are going to be around so don't let nobody like steal off your energy or steal your abundance and stuff like that was meant for you it's meant for you okay and it says your family is having a group conversation about you lying saying they know you when they really don't so this could be family members you don't even fool with you don't even talk to you don't even hang with this in your lover's ear telling him stuff about you they send up your line they don't even know you like that they are afraid of him wanting you so they're trying to try their best to block him from wanting you you're not bougie they're just broke so you can like nice things you can have nice things however you want to put it all right and they send up a hating they wonder how you're not being affected by isolation and lonely. Some people choose to be, okay? Just because somebody's alone doesn't mean that they lonely, all right? Some people just choose to have genuine loving people around them instead of being fake or accepting fake negative toxic stuff around them, okay? He is trying to avoid the car. I told y'all, the masculine may be trying to get away from someone or maybe you're trying to get away from someone. You put away feet. But somebody trying to get away from someone so they can head towards the one that they love or their happiness, period, okay? And they took a step back and refused to set you up because somebody was trying to set you up or steal something from you or put you in a bad situation, okay? When you see how you see money, protect your abundance. Let me say, I just can't get over you. Looking for ways to make my money. I was just saying it. Someone looking for ways to make my money. Um, yeah, but this is what this person wants. I want us to live together and create loving memories. Trying to get him to pay for something. See, somebody may be trying to get mass money out of the masculine as well. But it said, I don't care about her like I care about you. So that's what I'm saying. So the masculine could have options. All right. It could have chose somebody else over dealing with um lustful energy with another person or something like that. But it's like they wanna they planning to have some type of future with you or a baby with you or a family with you. But they also may be trying to get themselves together still, but still dealing with other people. Yeah. And somebody could have changed their hair color to look like yours or something. Or changed something to be like yours. What are we on right now? 28? Let me hurry up. Uh, and then we got trying to get people to not be your friend. So, it's like they, they was talking real bad about you. But I'm seeing I'm on my way to you. Hey, somebody got a secret stash or say trying to hide their money because somebody trying to steal another person's money or something, right? And it says they lied and said you do dark magic. So somebody was saying someone does magic or was doing spell work on another person, but they really wasn't. They was trying to make them see seem like they was a dark witch or something. And every time I turn around, they always asking for something. Somebody trying to use another person or take advantage. Yeah, but they were trying to, your masculine is realizing somebody was trying to be you or steal 
steal them from you. They tried to mimic your energy and then go after your man. But I'm on my way to you regardless. Your person is on their way to you regardless. But they're, they may not be outwardly saying it. The feds are watching. Other dudes are jealous of him because he want you. I mean, because he got you. And they got caught stalking. His homeboys could have got caught stalking you. The feds are watching. You need to start networking with strangers. He wants his family to love you as much as he loves you. So the family members could have had an issue with you at one point or something. He only called when he wants something. So, so okay. The masculine could have had homeboys who like to ask him for things as well. So if you're not having any issues with people are calling asking you for stuff, maybe your masculine was having issues with his homeboys asking for stuff. Maybe he just ain't having it right then or something like that. Or maybe he's starting to notice that he got leeches or something. After all I did for you, this is how you treat. See, somebody mad because they're not getting some type of money or they wanted something, okay? The karmic is crying out, trying to get help for themselves. Now, remember, karmics are not always the other woman. Karmics can be family members, friends, too, but they crying because they not getting something or they get they being defeated or something like that. So they crying to everybody, trying to cry wolf or something. You get what I'm saying? You need to start networking with strangers or just get some new friends. But this is sticking out. He lied to you when he told you you was the only one. So, if you was thinking you was the only one, he lied. Or maybe, I feel like this masculine might have told you a little bit about what was going on, but not everything. Didn't make some stuff completely clear or tell the complete truth. But you know, a half truth is a whole lie. So, it's like, a lot of stuff is being surfaced or being exposed that w that other people tried to keep hidden. But you can't keep, if you having, if you dealing with people at work, if you dealing with people... It's just getting messy. Everything is starting to be found out or being exposed. But he also may be trying to keep some of this away from you or something. What's in the middle? Trying to create fake beef with you for some clout. And it's, your masculine is starting to notice a lot of what was being said about you wasn't true. Which is like pissing him off even more. But he also having money issues or people asking him for money. Which is also adding on top of that. And it's like, could be making him tired or angry. But all he know that he want to fix things with you. He knows that for sure that he wants to fix things with you. Well, I, I, I can't make this up, y'all. Okay, they don't want you to know how bad things have gotten financially, and that's that has something to do with. So your masculine might need some help. Okay, if you're not the one that's needing help at the time, it might be your masculine. As soon as I open today. Sun, Leo, and then we got Aries. If your person may have, if you talked to them recently or not too long ago, and they said something to hurt your feelings, or they did something to hurt your feelings, they did not mean it. They really want to take it back because it was more involved in you. It was just like bad timing when when it happened. It was like they just going through a lot. So it wasn't you. Just know that it wasn't you. Because I don't know why I'm feeling that, but I'm feeling it right now. Okay? But they are sorry and regretful. We got Cancer, Jupiter, which is Sagittarius, and Gemini here. Uranus, which is Aquarius. Another Aquarius could be involved. We have Sagittarius. Heavy on the Sagittarius energy here. We have Saturn, which is Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo here. And we got Moon, which is Cancer energy. Oh, Cancer, Pisces energy. But somebody wants to remain here. And somebody's trying to hide the fact that they was involved here. Then we got an Earth sign, which is Cap Capricorn, Virgo, and Taurus. Okay. All right, so someone's definitely trying to block another person's business or entrepreneurship or something like that. They creativity. Because I was seeing that heavy. And your masculine could be trying to fight against something that was being done wrong towards you. Whether you know it or not. So please like this video if it resonates at all. Thank y'all so much. I love y'all.